Hi everyone! Today I'm going to be making some zucchini bread. I've never made it before, but I can't see how we could go so wrong. So, I just thought I might just vlog it because why not? You guys can all struggle with me. So I ran out of vegetable oil because I was making some weird spring roll things. I deep fry them. So I'm going out to get up to our bakery to get some vegetable oil. Earlier I was walking up here because I needed, I don't know what I even needed, but I came up here and I was wearing Burks and I stepped on one of those and I I've never <laughs> felt any more pain. Except for that one time Claudia stabbed me in the boot with a pitchfork, but that's a whole different story. This is our bakery. Doesn't look like much right now because it's getting redone. So if I go over here, there's some, but I might need some more. Um. Oh, there we go. I only need one of them. How do you take these things off? I don't know. So I found what I was looking for. And I got it. And also, shout out to Dusty, because I think this is his shirt. But I'm not really sure. And you guys know my bunny, Gibby. Well, yeah, he's missing. He keeps getting out. I have no idea how. But if you guys see him, let me know because I'm a worried mom. And I only have two right now. He could be in there. He was in the upstairs barn yesterday. But he is not home, and I'm gonna cry again. So there are his sisters. I don't know if you can see them. But I'm convinced the pigs ate him. So I have flour. I'm gonna start with the flour. And I'm gonna do three cups. Okay. And just so you know, I've never made this before, so if it comes out like crap, then don't laugh, okay? So, I have my flour. You're gonna preheat your oven to 325, but I did 330 because ours is five degrees off. So, I think. So I'm gonna do three cups of flour in a bowl. And I use all-purpose flour it's from Wegmans, if you're wondering. And then you're going to get your salt. That only took four years. Okay, one teaspoon of... I forgot to wash my hands. One teaspoon of salt. but whatever. Okay, one teaspoon of baking soda and one teaspoon of baking powder. Put those away. And one tablespoon of cinnamon. That's convenient. Is that satisfying? I believe you should put this in slow motion. Okay. Hey everyone, it's in my fridge. Thanks to those chicken farmers. Chicken farmers. 
I'm, I'm a chicken farmer. My chickens haven't laid any eggs yet because they're babies. Well, not really. They're like four months old. Maybe five, maybe six, seven. But they have not laid any eggs yet. I think I can, I can try to juggle. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna crack an egg. So you put three eggs in. <laughs> We're not even gonna talk about that. This is awesome. So then you're gonna do your next ingredient, which is some fat. Just kidding, it's just vegetable oil. One cup of vegetable oil. Woo, pouring skills. Two and a fourth cup of white sugar. Okay, so you got your sugar. Here's mine. And you do one. Did I do three eggs? Yeah. Two and a fourth. Just add a little extra if you want. Okay, that was my oven. It's telling me to hurry up. Three teaspoons of vanilla. So I don't know if you guys know the difference, but there's, I think it's imitation vanilla and it's like fake and then you got pure which is like the good stuff but it's a lot more expensive okay three of these and i usually do more because vanilla is like awesome but i'm not gonna let me show you guys what this looks like because i'm sure you're dying to know so this is what <laughs> it's so pretty you know what time it is zucchini time me and claudia call it zucchini it's a cute little name right i've never cut zucchini before but i think i think you just go ahead and grate it right wrap that baby baby i wonder if you guys are like actually going to use this recipe i don't know probably not i just answered my own question <laughs> Get your grater, and you need two cups, which sucks because this is gonna take a while. So I will, here, let me get that on. I will let you know when I'm done. And if you guys were wondering, we got these zucchinis, our zucchinis from in the middle of one of our pumpkin fields. One cup down, one to go. Okay, I have my second cup. And now I'm gonna clean up because I am a clean freak. And I hate when things are messy. I'm gonna add walnuts. You need one cup. Mine are already chopped up, because I'm just awesome. So you're going to do one cup of those. Oh, I don't know if I, guys, if I told you guys, but this recipe calls for two loaves. So Claudia and my dad want chocolate chips in theirs, but I don't. So I'm going to wait on those. Got to make them happy, right? So you dump that in there. And now you have everything in there so i'm gonna mix it now with this might need an electric beater probably can i just tell you guys that this smells so good because of cinnamon mm. dang okay i think i'm just gonna stick with this because it's working i don't even know what this is supposed to look like I don't know if it's supposed to look like this, but I'm home alone right now. It's kind of boring and lonely, but it's okay. It kind of looks like cat's puke. Spray my pans. I use Pam. 
I might need. semi-sweet because they taste more like chocolate, I think. That took like probably an hour and 10 minutes, but they're done. And they look beautiful. Oh, that's hot. Okay. Would you look at that? Looks so good. So that concludes my zucchini bread video. Thank you all for watching. And I hope you all have a good day. Look at my burn. It's really clearing up nice. Like, comment, and subscribe. And... I will see you guys in the next video. Gotta do my signature move. Okay, bye.